being authentically yourself or like being unapologetically yourself is is okay and people won't feel some type of way about it. So I feel like we should take that into if you're creative, you should take that into how you work in your your creative space too. It's mm. like it's like, oh hey, can you uh you know do this like quick revision? It's just like real quick. It's just like yeah, sure. My policy is this much for extra revisions, mm-hmm. or it's just like yeah. Uh, I'm actually working on something else right now. I would have to like move it down the priority list. Mm-hmm. Instead of us, we just kind of just like take the burden. And we're like, oh yeah, yeah, sure, no problem, I'll do it. And then, then you just like overwork your rate, or you, uh, or you don't seem as professional as you are. Cause I, I had noticed that yeah. recently with a shoot with a Michelle group. Shout out Jess, cause she's a G. Um, I gave him a whole pricing guy. I gave, told him what the deposit was, what the timing was going to be, like, very specific. This is what you're going to get, like, and that's it. And I got a huge response. I was able to photograph a ton of people and make a lot of money off it, which was great. Um, but I've noticed when you're, like, that type of person where just, like, this is what's going to happen, but, like, then you get talked over, and then, like, if they hire you again, they know they can take advantage of you, and, like, you yeah. just got to stick your ground. Like, this is what it is. If you want to work with me, you know what you're going to get. I feel like the more honest you are, like I said, unapologetically, like the more honest you are, the more people not necessarily will want to work. Well, no, they will want to work with you, but they just won't fuck with you, basically. Yeah, they respect you. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I've noticed that just yeah. recently because I'm still learning about mm-hmm. pricing and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, especially people that are kind of more on the business end because they want to be stern and want to be like, oh, I want you to do this and this. But at the same time, like, they don't, they don't pick up cameras every day. They don't. Mm-hmm. They don't know the process. Go, yeah, they don't go they don't know what home and go on Photoshop or go on. I don't know what you use to. What do you use for a program for all your it's videos? Like Adobe Suite, like Premiere, Adobe, Premiere, After Effects. Yeah, yeah, yeah it makes sense. Um, yeah, they've never opened Premiere or any Adobe thing, probably. Mm-hmm. Definitely not any Adobe thing. Yeah, that scares most people. <laughs> that's for sure. Exactly. So, like, I think that's really good advice. I think you need to, like, as a creative in this day and age, considering there are much more of us now because digital and because because there's much more of us there's there's much more variety and then there's also a much bigger market um i think you need to put your foot down sometimes and be like look i know what's best i've been doing this for so long if you if you hired me you trust me to some extent so exactly yeah and like there is that assumption that which is true that a lot of people will just go with somebody else because it's cheaper but like they're going to get that type of product. Yeah. It is what it is. And don't come back to me when your product is shit. Yeah. Because I'm doubling my rate. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Simple. Yeah. It's just a lot of, like, a lot of things in the creative world that people will learn once they're in it from experience. Mm-hmm. Making just, mistakes. Just a lot, of, a lot of things to learn. Uh, especially just, like, at a certain point, Yes, in the beginning, like, do a lot of free work, get your experience, experience, and, like, relationships will feed you forever. Short-term money will feed you short-term. Like, oh, I can make this much on, on this shoe, so I'm going to charge this much. But it's, like, you could build that relationship with that person, and then, like, they could just hire you forever, right? Exactly. But Or they'll hire you once, but later, you yeah. know, and you already work for them once, so that's double the money right there. 